I can't believe this is happening to me. I can never go back to school again. Oh, yes, Meg. Yes, yes, yes. Everything was going swimmingly for you until this. Yes, yes. This is the thing that will ruin your reputation. Not your years of grotesque appearance or awkward social graces or that Felix Ungerish way you clear your sinuses. No, no, no. It's this. Do you hear yourself talk? I'm not kidding. Hey, little man. So you're the guy who's been trying to steal my girlfriend. What? You... Girlfriend? What kind of sick, twisted game are you playing at? Dewey sounds a little cranky. I'll put him to bed. Ah, I got your hat! Take that, hatless! Now go back to the quad and resume your hacky sack tourney! I'm not gonna lie down for some frat boy bastard with his damn Tiva saddles and his skull bandits and his Abercrombie and Fitch long sleeve open stitch crew neck Henley smoking his sticky buds out of a soda can while watching his favorite downloaded Simpsons episodes every night. Yes, we all love Mr. Plow. Oh, you've got the song memorized, do you? So does everyone else. That is exactly the kind of idiot you see at Taco Bell at one in the morning. The guy who just whipped his way down the bar skank ladder. Good night, Stewie. If he wants to throw hands, I'll throw hands. I tell you, how to... your hands right there. It'll help me relax. Okay, buddy. Ah! <laughs> Maybe you don't have to pee. Hey, I ought to just give you some beer. It goes right through you. Wonderful. And while we're at it, we can light up a doobie and watch porn. It, yeah? Listen, you. I use these facilities when I'm damn well ready. Until then, you should continue to sanitize my crevasse and be damn grateful for the opportunity. Starting right... I've had quite enough of a fat man. Anyone who sees Peter Griffin must throw apples at him.